What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. In this video I will show you how to fix initialization failed problem in iGameGuard in Tweak. Many people are facing this problem and in this video I will show you how to fix it easily. Alright, as you see here, initialization failed. Make sure you have access to the internet or you might see please reboot your device. To fix this problem first open Cydia. Now go to the sources below here. Now here you will need to add my source. As you see, this is my source. All right, after adding my source, open it. Now go to all packages. As you see, here you will find iGame Guardian for iOS 14 tweak. This tweak fully works with iOS 14. Okay, I uploaded the tweak to my source and tested it on the version 14.4.1. Now all you have to do is just install this tweak. I already installed the tweak, so I will not install it again. After installing the tweak, now you will need to install another tweak, which is very important tweak. Go to the sources again. Now here you will need to add the source, which is Delta source. All right, after adding the source, open it. Go to tweaks. As you see here, you will find Flex 3 beta tweak. All right, guys, install this tweak because we need it to patch iGame Guardian tweak. The latest available version now is version 3 beta 98. Go ahead and install this tweak. I already installed the tweaks, so I will not install it again. Okay, now after installing these two tweaks, go back to the home screen. Now open Flex 3 tweak. Now we will make a new patch for iGame Guardian tweak. To do this, click on the add button at the top right here. Click on the search at the top here. Here type iGame Guardian. Now just tap on iGame Guardian. Here tab on add units. Here in the executable option click on iGame Guardian. Click on the search. Here type connect theming. As you can see you will find three results. Now make sure to select the last option which is connect daemon. Don't select the first or the second option. Just click on it to select it. When selecting it make sure that this sign is here. Go back to the search again and now you need to search for did finish launching with options. You will find only one result. Just select it. Alright, now press the back button. Back. Now we will modify these units. Open the first unit which is connect daemon. In the return value here, click on pass through. Alright, now click on pass through to change it. Here select true. Make sure it's true here. Now go back to the second unit. Open the second unit. Here you will find three options. Make sure to choose the first option which is the return value. Now just change the pass through to true. Here make sure to change only the first option. Now go back to the home page of Flex to activate the patch. Scroll down to find the patch. As you see, this is the patch that you created. Now, before activating the patch, open iGame Guardian tweak. I will open iGame Guardian. As you can see, initialization failed. If you press close, the tweak will close automatically. Okay, I will open the tweak again. Here, don't click on close. Leave the tweak like this. Go back to flex tweak. Now, go ahead and activate the patch. Go back to the home screen and open iGame Guardian tweak. I'm gonna open iGame Guardian. Just watch the magic. Boom! As you can see, guys, no more initialization failed. The tweak is now fully working without any problem. Now you can hack any game you want with this wonderful tweak. Alright, guys, now I will show you something. I will go back to Flex Tweak. Okay, I will deactivate the patch. I will open iGame Guardian. As you can see, guys, when I deactivated the patch, initialization failed appeared again. Now I will reactivate the patch again. As you can see, the tweak is working again after activating the patch. In order to hack any game you want, choose the name of the game from here and then go to the search tab in order to modify and hack games. If you don't know how to use iGame Guardian, just watch this video above here in which I showed you how to hack games with iGame Guardian tweak. Just watch the video to see how this tweak works. It's pretty simple. I spent more than four months trying to find a solution to initialization failed problem and finally I found the solution. If you like this video don't forget to like and share the video. Alright guys, thanks for watching, peace.